we're here for the launch of the GA World Games, which will be held in Abu Dhabi next March. The Middle East County Board have decided that they want to do this, they want to be the first to do it. They're holding it in Abu Dhabi. We're delighted that a unit in the organisation in the international GA has decided to take it on. Etihad are supporting it and we're delighted to support it also. Gaelic Games are going to become a global phenomenon in our lifetime, I think, and this is the start of it. We saw the huge interest around the world uh, brought by the TV coverage going all around the world. And as I said at the press conference today, last year's at Ireland final was talked about all over Ireland. This year's one was talked about all over the world. And that's a hugely significant thing. And a lot of people born outside Ireland are playing our games now. They're taking them up as adults. They want their children playing. And I think that at some stage in the future, we will see a world competition where people born in the countries will play Gaelic games for their country. I was back in Ireland for the international hurling competition in Galway uh, last year um, and I think having sort of had a team from the Middle East playing in that and, and winning the competition they were in, it sort of reignited the whole idea about bringing teams from around the world together. Because that weekend there was a number of teams uh, that had flown in for the weekend and it was a great celebration of, of hurling and I just thought that we need to continue to do this at, on a world stage. The games will be in the Al Zayed Sports City complex. They've got 14 international pitches uh, uh, on that ground. So we'll have first class facilities to play our games, we'll have first class facilities for people to stay in and we'll be running a number of events over the weekend and they will be top class as well. We're just, I suppose, a bit oblivious to the fact how good the games actually are um, until you get the reaction of um, someone who hasn't seen it before. Different sports come to Ireland, different people try them, so it's no different when hurling or football goes abroad and people will try them. To promote it, you need an actual something to, to focus on, which is now happens to be this world tournament. Like You can't say, oh, they've, I know you have competitions in America, maybe you've one or two in Europe, but now they have a, a a worldwide tournament they can actually focus on look we can aim we can get a travel over we can meet our friends they can all meet there so at least it's something hopefully they can build on my mother and father put me in because it's a social aspect of the game it's not it's not whether if you're playing into county or you're you're playing junior for a club it's the social aspect that it brings you together it brings people together a community and that just happens to be now a community abroad etihad commenced our relationship with the ga six years ago and we have looked since that to develop to further develop that and to um take the GA and the games on into an international env um, environment and arena. And I think this gives us an opportunity to do that again. It also gives us the opportunity to showcase our home in Abu Dhabi um, for everybody to see and to, to show everybody what that has to offer. And it's also absolutely wonderful for us to be able to be involved with the GA in this in terms of showcasing our games to the Middle East, but also to other people from around the world. The GA World Games is going to be run from a Thursday through to a Saturday, so the 5th, 6th and 7th of March next year in Abu Dhabi. So it'll open up on the 5th with the Business Forum. So we'll have a, it's a chance for networking amongst uh, professionals that are based in the region and beyond. We've got 24 teams across the nine international units. So on the first day we're going to have a round robin group games, which will then progress into Saturday for a knockout competition, your semi-finals and your finals in both a cup and a plate format. Make sure to support 2015 GAA World Games in Abu Dhabi. Mm -hmm.